Okay. So I wanted to come on here and make another follow-up video, and this is more for, for the TIs. Um, what goes on in gang stalking and what your perps are actually doing. Your perps tend to think that you have this like great life, and what they try to do is they want to reduce the quality of it, okay? In any way they can. Now, from my perspective, my life is very sad, okay? Um, I'm around people that I don't like. I have never liked the people that I'm around because they're always associated with the people that I know. Okay, so that means that my life is not very fulfilling. Okay, um, I work jobs where I'm basically bought in to be bullied. That's the only reason why I'm there. Um, so I don't, but they still, even though they ruin all of your life, they still always want to chip away at something. It's, I, I kind of look at the story like Rumpelstiltskin, how like Rumpelstiltskin's willing to help this woman with her task of she needs to supply gold so he makes a deal with her but the deal was where she has to give her for firstborn right it's like they want you to rely on them but you have to pay a price somehow this is this is the way that they think it's like it's not a, they, they didn't give me jobs so they can help me raise my son they got me jobs so they can hurt me this is what it is terry collins has serious problems and so does the rest of my family, okay? I, and, and they want to, they want me to gain weight. They don't want me to look nice. They, they want me to hate myself just as much as they hate themselves. And this is what it is. It's a, it's a, it's a um, form of bullying a person to the point of where they can no longer take life anymore. And this is what it is. Now, some people think, you know, I don't know, people always think that my life is so great. It's not a great life. I live a very unhappy life. Okay? I don't have any friends that I trust. People that smile on my face, I fucking hate them all. Why? Because they're associated with these people. And if you're associated with these people, you cannot be any good. It's that simple. You know what I mean? No, I mean, and they always want to sit here and, re and, and, and hurt your life even more. Now, they have put me to the point where I'm, at, I'm, I'm extremely depressed. I hate waking up in the morning. I seriously hate waking up in the morning. It's like, I, I wake up and I'm like, oh my gosh. And I notice I do sleep in more because I can't deal with the reality anymore. Because the reality is, is that these people have made my life very difficult. You know, Terry Collins basically try, re, almost refuses to get out of my life. I don't like her, but she continues to set herself and put herself in, in front of me. Like that job interview today. I'm pretty sure that was her doing. Okay, I kept saying I, it triggers me. She wants to. She gets a charge out of it. When bully people bully people, this is what happens. They get excited about it. Okay, and it's her way of saying, "Oh, it's for your best good." I don't. How is it for my best good? Because I can fit in with the rest of society. I'm not interested in fitting in with the rest of society, and I have the right not to. If society weighs three thousand pounds or three hundred pounds, that's my choice not to be that way. And legally, I can't be discriminated because of it. But it's your personal preference because she envies that. Okay, I, I prefer wearing my own clothes, which I've said so several times. Okay, it's nothing wrong to like your own wearing your own clothes. There's a lot of people who, like I said in the past, who and there's people who have on, on, on what do you call it, blogs and forums and stuff that talk about it. They go to work and they're depressed. This one girl was talking about how she can't wait to find another job. She really wants to because she hates wearing that uniform. I hate wearing the uniform. Toy. Because what the uniform is, it, what it is, is it stands for is we hired you to bully you. We know you don't want to wear this. But we think it's funny that you have to wear it. And you have to do what we say. It is not in any way, form, or construction. It's all about bullying. And I'm well aware of this. Okay? I don't want the job. Okay? And it's not about it because I need to move on from my life. Okay? I'm sorry that you guys ever got involved. These, these people ever got involved in my life. I didn't consent to it. But I was forced into that situation. You know? I was forced into it. I didn't ask for it. You know, I wonder about my life every day. What's going to happen to my life? You know, they've taken so much. You know, they don't they don't want you to date anyone. Okay, don't, don't get me wrong. I'm not interested in dating. But the point is, it's like they would want to force Bruce on me. I don't want Bruce. Okay, I fucking hate that man. I fucking hate him. I don't ever want to see him. And don't sit here and think, oh, she'll change her mind. No. You are the most, you're the epitome of what could possibly be demonic. You and your sister Jennifer. 
Okay, Terry is another one. You know, I don't know, she's sick. I felt sick today at the interview. And those people who interviewed me, if they knew what was going on, which I'm sure they pretty much did, then they're sick too. Okay, I, I, I'm very unhappy with the situation that I'm in. Okay, um, I need to feel in control of my life. You know what I mean? I don't know what I'm doing, but here's the thing. I would rather die out in the street than have to deal with these people. That's the truth. Because I know some people are thinking, well, you know, you could just marry him or you can do whatever. You can make your life easier. No, it will not. I would rather die than be associated with these people. That is not a joke. Okay, I'm not happy about being in that situation. I'm not happy about working with people who bully me. You're, you're hiring people. You're bringing somebody in for... It, it, you're, you're trying to make somebody do something they don't want to do. You're bullying them. I'm not, I, I don't want to be hired to be the laughing stock of whatever. It's bullying. I don't feel comfortable with it. Stop trying to reduce the quality of my life. You've already reduced the quality of my life. It's obvious. You know, what kind of sick person are you really, Terry? Okay, and I, if my son watches my videos, I don't know if he does or not, because I don't ever have this conversation with him. Okay, what these people do is wrong. Do not ever do this to a normal human being. Okay, it's not right to do this to a woman. It's wrong to do it to a woman. The law says so, and I will tell you, from my emotional experience, from everything that I've gone through in my life, it is the worst thing you could ever do to another human being. Okay, regardless of what kind of smile this woman wears on her face, she's fucking evil. And he's evil. Jennifer's evil, and I don't know what Rick is. You know, he's one of those creepy people that sit there and sits on the couch all day, doesn't say anything, but he's got some other agenda going on. I never asked him to do anything for me. You know, I don't want to remember these people. I don't want any fucking association with these people. I want to go on with my life. And I want to heal. You know, what you've asked me to do is too much. You know, I'm not going to change my life. So we're going to, we're either going to have somebody dead, which you're going to be responsible for, Terry, or you're going to leave me alone because I'm not responsible for your fucking problems. And I'm wrapping up this video and I don't want any more interviews and like that. And no, I don't want the fucking job.